Ever wonder what the biggest thing in the universe is? Well, now you can find out with my new book, The Biggest Stuff in the Universe. Just Google Mr. DeMeo Books and you'll find it. Wait a second. I think something's wrong with our spaceship. It keeps making a weird noise. What noise? That noise. Oh, relax. I'm sure everything is going to be perfectly fine. Just do what I do. Play the radio louder and pretend nothing's wrong. Okay. Hello, Mata. Hello, boy. Uh-oh, Andy. I don't think your trick worked. System failure. Spaceship will self-destruct in three minis. Hurry up! Hit a button or something! How about this one? No, it's this one! spaceship anyway. Sometimes when we touch, the honest is too much. What? Wait! I'm conveniently starting to remember something. What? The spaceship's trash compactor. There's a button down there that releases all of our waste, but resets the ship. Well, is anyone down there to hit it? Unfortunately, yes. Steve! Grandpapa? Is that you? No, enough with the Grandpapa stuff. I need you to hit the bright red button and reset the ship. Oh, okay, I can do that. But, uh, quick question. What color is red? What? What do you mean, what color's red? It's red! Okay, I get that, but how would you describe it? Ugh, we couldn't have water balloon guy or raspberry lime down there. It just had to be Steve. Let me try. Hey, Stevie, old buddy, old pal. Grandpapa? Yes, it's Grandpapa. Listen, do you remember when we went to the mall and you sat on that guy's lap and told him what you wanted for Christmas? Oh, yeah. That's when I got my first restraining order. What? Whatever. Just do me a favor and hit the button that matches that guy's clothes. Oh, why didn't you say that earlier? <laughs> I know we saved our spaceship, but man, that was gross. Wait a second, did that come from us? If I had to guess, that came from Steve. Yeah. Well, I did have Chipotles last night. That's not what you think it is. It's Oumuamua. Oumuamua. That's kind of like a cow that's confused. Oh! Moo. Uh, moo. Uh, you get it? Because it's kind of like confused because it's a cow. Here, let me explain. Originally discovered on October 19th, 2017 by the Pan Stars 1 telescope in Hawaii, which tracks and finds asteroids and comets in Earth's neighborhood, this strange object was officially named 1I-2017-U1. What? But in addition to its technical name, it was also called Oumuamua. The word Oumuamua is Hawaiian and it is loosely translated to scout or messenger. In a 1922 dictionary of the Hawaiian language, the word Oumuamua is defined as the foremost soldier or the front rank in battle and a scout, one sent forward before a battle to discover the position of the enemy. So is this object a scout sent from a faraway world to look at us? Well, no one knows for sure. We're not 100% certain where it started, but we do know that this object came from outside of our solar system, from the direction of the bright star Vega in the northern constellation of Lyra, and it is quickly moving deep into outer space. This makes it difficult to see using our telescopes on Earth. Because it's moving so fast away from us, many of the questions about Oumuamua may never be answered. But what we have seen suggests that this unusual object has been wandering through the Milky Way for hundreds of millions of years before its encounter with us. You keep calling it an object, but what is this thing exactly? Yeah, it looks like a giant Snickers bar floating in space. What? Well, it was thought to be a comet at first, and then an asteroid. But to be honest, this object doesn't behave like either of those things. 
So really, it's the first of its kind. So we've never seen anything like this before. Not at all. And since it's moving so fast and so far away from Earth, we've had a hard time really figuring out anything about it. Precisely. What are we waiting for? Let's make this thing talk! Wait! We don't know anything about this thing yet. It could have a really annoying voice. Or worse, it could sound like Steve. Oh no! Hey, I can hear you down here! Andy, how often do we come across weird objects in outer space that we can make talk? About once a month. Yeah. Yeah, but how many of those things look like a Snickers bar? He could lead us to a candy planet with a Kit Kat King! Or a Sour Patch Princess. You had me at Candy Planet. Blast this bad boy. I want to hear him talk. Here goes nothing. Hey, you got the Gabagool? What? Yo Gabagala. The Gabagool. I go out and provide for this family and this is the type of respect I get? I, uh, I'm not sure what a Gabagool is, but I was kind of hoping you could get us some candy. Candy? What, the Gabagool isn't good enough for you? Oh. I'm sorry, Oumuamua. I can get you the gobbledygook. Gabagool! Gabagool later if you, uh, answer some questions that we have. I can do that. But if I don't get my gobbledygool soon, you'll be swimming with the fishes. Yeah. Oh, I like swimming. What kind of fish will there be? Bass? Grouper? Stripers? Uh, Andy, I don't think that's what that means, but deal. No more candy talk. Let's start with some numbers. I heard you were really big and traveling fast. Well, I don't like to brag, but it's true. Well, first off, experts aren't even sure what I'm made of, but some think I'm made of frozen nitrogen, just like the surface of Pluto in Neptune's largest moon, Triton. The leading theory is that an impact knocked a chunk off an icy nitrogen-covered planet 500 million years ago and sent the piece tumbling out of its own star system towards you. And over time, I've gradually eroded to the shape I am today. Think of me like a bar of soap, changing shape as you use it more. I have a slightly reddish color, and I'm known for my weird shape and size. I'm estimated to be under half a mile long, and up to 550 feet thick. Wow. That's longer than seven football fields. Not only am I big, but I'm moving quick too. I'm traveling at 60,000 miles per hour. That's over 2,000 times faster than Usain Bolt. And the weird thing is, I have even gotten faster as I've traveled through your solar system. With speeds reaching up to 196,000 miles per hour. What? That's almost a thousand times faster than a Ferrari. It's believed that I travel about 500 million miles per year. And after January 2018, I was no longer visible to telescopes. Hey, where'd you go? So, I am now headed out of the solar system and will never come back. What, so you're not a candy bar? I just told you, no one's really sure. So you're telling me there's a chance you're made out of candy? Well, probably not, I would melt and then- But there's a chance. If I say yes, will you stop talking about candy? Probably not. Then sure, there's a tiny chance I made a candy. Andy, are you thinking what I'm thinking? That when we mow our lawns, we're giving the Earth a haircut. And if we charge the Earth for said haircuts, we could be millionaires by- but No, Soggy Otter has a chocolate factory. So what? So if we can find a way to get Oumuamua back to him, we can make like space candy bars. Yeah. I like my Earth haircut idea better, but I'm in. Hey, Oumuamua. What? I just got off the phone with the uh, president of the um, planet, and he just told me that he has a very special gift for you. What is it? Tell me. I'll give you a hint. I have no idea what it is, but it rhymes with schmamagool. What? <gasps> gabagool, gabagool, gabagool. Oh, he got away, and he's moving fast. I think he's headed right for, oh no. And I have to close my eyes. Oh no! Not again! This video could not be made without the help from my patrons on Patreon. Especially Jacob Paduzzi Thorpe, Nadia and Hannah, Robin Hill, GC, Grant and Ara Brown, Tyner and Eleanor Bosch, Simon, Natalie, and Liam McNulty. Zeno the Shark, 
Tobin and Nina, Rebecca and Sarah F. from Pennsylvania, Mary Margaret M., Oshi, Gavin Watt and his cool dad, Anders and Elon, Mrs. Brown's first grade, Kuchan115, Caden Coslin, Reese, Ian, Parker, and Braylon Callis, Elliot Ulysses Coyne, Haley and Ethan Hebbard, Mia Ladybug and Ian Ant, Ani and Arjun Iyer, Amador Baggerly, Evan Gray, Evan Lee, Jason the Kid Parker, Kai Kim, Corbin, Sawyer, and Thatcher, Ada S., Gavin and Ian Eshte, Stephen McPhee, Ella Loves Chicken Parmesan, James Berg Pfeiffer III, Hannah Y., Aiden Fenway Riley, Lily, Annabelle, Thomas, and Everett, Leo Calandra, Amelia and Alan Mills, Asa Paul, The McHugh Brothers, Connor and Emma B., Renko, Kostya, and Yaro, Jack and Easton Hess, Hannah, Maya, and Zoe, Asher Evans, Henry Pavelko, Ollie and Cami, Aiden Swift, Jameson and Nolan, Charles and Olivia, Riker Y, Leah and Gavin Clark, Creative Devin and Zach T, Macklin, Nakia Swift, Timmy C, Bennett E, aka Pooh Bear, Autumn McBottom and Beeg Sauce, Gabriella and Carnacion, Marshall G, Jordana and Aaron, Callum G, Marlo Reynolds and Henry the Leprechaun King, Toothless and Light Fury, Edwards, Mr. Fast and Mr. Red, Violet S and Mercury, Miera and Mrs. Lagrande's second grade class, Giovanni, Grayson and Giselle Q, Avery L, Rory, Michael and Papa Siberio, Leif, Lake and Ember Anderson Miller, Oliver from Ottawa, Elijah Robert, Cora, Ayer and Jovi Douthat, Kate and Sarah, Luke and Lily Herlitz, Rowan Scheibels, Isley and Jude Siegel, Lillian and Davis Sozin, Harper, Lily and Thatcher McCoy, Harry, Mika, Jordan and Maya, Asunta and Luigi Retta, Jasper Source Rex, Ethan and Axel, Aiton Judah, Harrison Eastwood, Lizzie, Dean and Trevor, Cosette, Domino and Butters the Chipmunk, Luke, Henry Q and Stacy Q, The Gauker Family, Dean Scandalakis, Rebecca Beanie, Asher S, Adeline Fitzgerald, Ainsley and Braden and Yardley, Greg Matlock, Lennon McCartney, Jones Page, Avalon and Cash, The Rivard Boys, Carter, Levi and Fletcher, Ronan X and Raiden Z, Matthew and James Mondiello, Gavin Meidel, Noah Chin, Max C, Wesley C, Xander and Lucinda, Connor LeCoque and Family, Marley and Lennon Kimsey, Emma Kennedy, Mabel and Graham, Nora Close, Jordan Montgomery, Christopher F, John Douglas Kraft, Santi Barajas, Brandon Favaza and Mommy, Gavin Huggin, Finn, Libby, Oliver, Ezra and Heidi, Sam and Eddie from London, Arthur Watson, Breton and Cosette. Do you want to get your name in a video too? Well, visit patreon.com backslash Mr. DeMeo. If you sign up, you can get your name in a video, see my videos early, help me pick my next topic, and more. Check the description box for a link. Now let's do some fan art. I got this one from Luca in California. He drew the snack stand from my Mosasaurus video. That's pretty cool, unique. I got this one from Jude in California. He drew Steve from my blooper video and he pretended he was the tooth fairy. New blooper video coming soon, by the way. I got this one from a kid named Kenza who drew basically everybody, especially Soggy Otter. I love drawings of Soggy Otter. And there's this one from LB in Texas who drew Justin with a whole bunch of other Justins from Europa. That's pretty cool. I got this one from Dylan in California. He drew Krusty Face, Rapspray Lime, everybody. That's pretty cool, Dylan. Thanks. I got this one from John from the Pritzker School in Chicago. He and all his classmates wrote to me, and I just wanted to say hi, and I love your picture. And last, I got a bunch of nice letters from Eden 2 Programs, a school in Staten Island. They wrote to me so many nice things, and you guys can write to me too at Mr. DeMeo, P.O. Box 58, Keyport, New Jersey, 07735. <laughs>